Hi, this is a quick demo of using geometry scripting, a new experimental feature in Unreal Engine 5.0. However, instead of using a blueprint like I've been doing in my other videos, I'm going to use a Python script. Every geometry scripting function is available in Blueprint and also in Python. So I'm not going to write the Python script in this video. It's a little long, but what this Python script does is it does a boolean between these two objects and also outputs a new mesh with the materials as you might expect. So I'm going to select this wall and I'm going to click on shift select these three sort of uh, mossy spheres and then I'm going to go to uh, tools execute python script and I'm going to pick this script I already made. I'll post the script uh, online and post a link in the video description. So it's called subtractor actors. I'm going to run it and after a second it runs and you see here in my content browser a new asset was created that is the boolean of these objects. Here's another example where I have two mega scans of uh, rocks or cliffs and I want to make a cave in the left cliff so what I'm going to do is just take this right one and drag it in there make sure it's not poking out the other side and I'm going to do the boolean between these two. Now these are each two million triangles so very high resolution meshes and you see this one is completely on open on the bottom. These are both things that the Booleans and Unreal Engine handle quite well. It is going to take about a minute or two to do this computation, so I'm going to make the selection, uh, start the Boolean, and then we'll skip ahead. Okay, the Boolean just finished. It took about a minute and a half on my computer. Let's drag it into the level and slide it over, and we can see that we've created uh, a cave in this cliff and you see that the UVs and textures were preserved across the operation. There's two materials assigned, one for each of the original materials. Uh, and so we have a, a new asset uh, with 2.3 million triangles. We can turn on Nanite and use this asset uh, in our level. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.